Hello everybody, what is going on? Steggy here with a video review on the Woo Audio HPS R headphone stand. Now for those of you who watch my videos, I review headphones and headsets that can cost hundreds of dollars, and there are headphones that I don't cover that reach well beyond those figures. Now the problem we can run into when we buy this audio gear is how do we display our investments when we aren't wearing them. Luckily, some companies produce stands that allow you to display your headset or headphone in style on your desk, one of which is from a company called Woo Audio. What I have for you today is the HPSR stand from Woo Audio, and if you want to find out why this is my favorite headphone stand out there, stick past the break. Now before I get into specifics, let's open the package you get with the headphone stand. Here's the box that Woo Audio ships to you, and when you open it up, you are greeted with high quality foam protecting the aluminum components to the headphone stand. Now the headphone stand has these components that you have to put together. Now there aren't any instructions that come with the stand, but as you can see here, setup couldn't be simpler. After you pop on the rubber feet, you just need to screw in the bottom column into the base, screw the telescoping rod into the headphone rest, and pop that rod into the column, and then pop the screw in and secure everything together. The HPSR is very high quality. All components are solid aluminum. Woo Audio has a few different options when you go to their website to purchase one of these headphone stands. There are currently two different models of the series of headphone stand. The HPSR for single headphones, and the HPST for two headphones. Each model is available in black and silver, and for those wondering, the silver looks great sitting next to a MacBook. The HPSR sells at $59, while the HPST sells at $75. Now I know some of you might think that this is a high cost, but one, these aren't meant to display your iBuds, they're meant to display a fine piece of audio gear, and two, the quality and design more than make up for the price. Now I have used a few headphone stands before getting the Woo Audio HPSR in. When I got my Sennheiser HD 595s about 5 or so years ago, they came with a Sennheiser HH10 clipping headphone stand. It was a nice freebie, the bridge of the stand was nice and wide so you can accommodate multiple types of headphones and causes minimal stress on the headphone headbands, but the stand is limited to where you can only clip it onto a shelf which A limits where you can place your headphones and B looks pretty awful with the cord dangling. It's very hard to have things look nice this way. I then moved on to attempting my own do-it-yourself project for a desktop headphone stand. There's a great thread over on HeadFi for examples and works of other people. The problem with this stand is that I've had a bunch of wood, PVC, and stains lying around in a pile in my garage. The third headphone stand I moved on to came from Astro Gaming. Priced at about $35, it's on the more affordable side, and like the Woo Audio HPSR, it's made out of aluminum. This has been my go-to headphone stand until I got the HPSR in, so let's break down the two and compare them. So with the Astro headset stand and the Woo Audio stand being made out of aluminum, are you really getting more for that extra $25? I would definitely say so, and here are three reasons why. Number one, the base. The HPSR has a solid foundation with a 6 inch circle aluminum base holding the stand up. I could punch this thing and not knock it over, but that would hurt my hand, so I'm not going to do that. The Astro headset stand has a pretty minimal design with a smaller base. While a gust of wind won't knock it down, a decent nudge to the side can. Number two, the HPSR has better ergonomics, with a telescoping rod that allows you to adjust the height depending on your needs. The Astro headset stand does not. Number three, probably the biggest advantage of the HPSR over the Astro headset stand is the top bridge of the stand. I noted earlier with the Sennheiser HH10 that a wider bridge puts less stress on your headphone. This is the case with the HPSR as well. It may seem silly to some, but audiophiles with near priceless cans Know what I'm talking about when I say that the stress from where you rest your headphones should be considered. You want as much surface area for your points of contact as possible to evenly distribute your headphones weight to the stand so less stress is put on the headband so it lasts longer over time. Think of it as force per square inch. If a person were to stand on you with a pair of sneakers, it might be uncomfortable, but if that same person were to stand on you wearing a pair of stiletto heels, you'd be crying uncle. Secondly, what the wider bridge allows you to do with the headphone stand is use a wider array of headphones for it. Some headphones have really wacky designs for the headband, most notably off the top of my head is the Audio-Technica 8700s. You can't just put these on a stand like the Astro headset stand, but you can with the Woo Audio HPSR. All in all, the HPSR is a great headphone stand. Like I've said, it's my favorite out there. Some people might gawk at the $60 price tag, considering a lot of people spend that amount of money on their headset itself, but for those who are looking to stylishly display your audio equipment, it doesn't get much better than the HPSR from Woo Audio. So that'll do it for my video review on the Woo Audio HPSR. For more information, visit their website at wooaudio.com. And as always, if you like this video, be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe as it really does help me out. And if you guys own this headphone stand, let me know what you think about it in the comment area down below. 
Do you use another headphone stand? Feel free to share what you've made or purchased down below as well. Anyways, once again, this is Steggy with a video review on the Woo Audio HPSR headphone stand. And until my next video, I will catch you guys later.